Hello, good day everyone. In the question we have today, we have a square shaped quadrilateral drawn in an equilateral triangle. This line was drawn such that it bisects the length of this side here. And we have this side to be 100 millimeters in length. We are to find the size of this angle X. So how can we solve it? Okay, the way we've been doing it in the past videos, we start solving from somewhere until we reach our target but in today's video we're going to start from the target that is angle x until we arrive at our answer now if you look at angle x it is the angle this side makes with this side and this side is parallel to this side we know because they both are sides of the same square that implies that this line is a transversal between two parallel lines a transversal line we know form alternate angles with the parallel line which are congruent so what this is trying to tell you is that this angle and this angle are equal so since this is x this must also be x now recall this same line bisect this side that is it divided into two equal parts so if you assume the length of this side to be a this must also be a but the whole line is a side of this square and we have its length to be 2a that implies that this, this and this side must also be 2a each now if you assume the length of this side to be b from this triangle you can use a so-called tour taking this angle as theta this is the opposite and this is the adjacent from here tan theta equal to opposite over adjacent Theta is x, opposite is 2a plus b, and adjacent is a. So tan x equal to 2a plus b all over a. 2a plus b all over a is the same as 2a over a plus b over a. Here a cancels a, so tan x equal to 2 plus b over a. Another thing we should consider is that this side here is parallel to this side. And we know the rule. That if a line is drawn parallel to one side of a triangle to intersect the other two sides in this thick point, the sides are divided in the same ratio. What I'm trying to prove from this rule here is that this line here divides this line and this line in the same ratio. And since the whole triangle is an equilateral triangle, that means this side and this side must be equal in length, and this and this must also be equal in length. Let's say the length is C. That even prove the congruency of this and this triangle because one of the criteria for judging the congruency of two triangles is termed RHS. R means the both triangles should have a right angle in them which you can see there is a right angle and there is also a right angle. H means both should have hypotenuse of the same length and H means one of the other two sides should correspond in length and we can see this and this side are equal in length the congruent triangle we know have the same length for all three corresponding sides. So since this is B, this must also be B. Now this angle we know is 60 degrees because it is the angle of an equilateral triangle PQR. Now from this right angle triangle, if we use a so tour, taking this as theta, this is the opposite and this is the adjacent. Here tan theta equal to opposite of our adjacent. Theta is 60 degrees, opposite is 2a, and adjacent is b, so tan 60 degrees equal to 2a over b. We multiply both sides by b. Here b cancels b, and here tan 60 degrees times b is b tan 60 degrees, so b tan 60 degrees equal to 2a. We divide both sides by a now. Here a cancels a, and here b tan 60 degrees over a is same as b over a tan 60 degrees so b over a tan 60 degrees equal to 2 we go ahead and divide both sides by tan 60 degrees here tan 60 degrees will cancel tan 60 degrees and here 2 divided by tan 60 degrees if you press your calculator is 1.1547 so b over a equal to 1.1547 recall this our equation tan x equal to 2 plus b over a 
And here we found that B over A equal to 1.1547. So we substitute it. 2 plus 1.1547 is 3.1547. So turn X equal to 3.1547. And from this, the exact value of X would be tan inverse of 3.1547, which is 72.4 degrees. So X equal to 72.4 degrees. And that is the size of the angle we are asked to calculate. Thank you for watching. Please, if you are yet to subscribe to this channel, please do subscribe, like, share, and comment. Thank you.